All right, we're gonna start here in metals. Let's see what we can find. This is cute with the butterflies. Stained glass look. 309 for that, that's really cute. I know my arm's not long enough to show you. But that's really cute. Oh, there's some glass pieces missing on that. Oh well. This piece is still sitting in the same exact spot it was a week ago when I was here. 509 for that. Candle holders. We have some uh, travel mugs. Paper towel holder. There's some kind of mold. Bunny mold. Some planters. That's cute. And this is hand painted, it looks like. All sorts of fruit around it. Yeah, it's all hand painted. That's neat. Like that. Bayou Billy Homebrew. A little birdhouse. There's a little brass container. Very cute. And there's a little paperweight that you put a picture in. Glass photo. Is this a Vera? Let me see. There's a lot of these bam. They're not. Hmm. They have a hole in the bottom. They're not where I thought they were. Try to get this one out. It is a Vera. Okay. Get the Vera. Here's wind chimes. Um. Is that on the wind chimes? Or is that? Oh, trying to get them out of here. This is what metal aisle is always like. I can't get them out. All right, I'm going to do that when we get off of uh, camera here. Uh, oh, I like that butter dish. Oh, it's plastic. That's cute. A little Southwestern, two forty nine for that. A strainer. This is for. Uh, I believe that's for toilet paper. Big candle holders. This is very cute, but it's five oh nine. Well, cottage core, farmhouse core, whatever you want to call it. That's really cute. Some trays. That's a nice one. Pretty, pretty. And some other displays and holders. That's pretty with the roses on it. And a little bell. Alright, that's it here for the metal. Let me go try to get that uh, the wind chimes loose. Alright, we're in cups and glasses, but as you can see, they did pull quite a bit here. It's very empty. Um, wow. What can I say about this? He's cute. Little penguin mug. Proud Air Force mom. And some Christmas mugs. Various glasses. Rebel IPA. Samuel Adams. Okay. That's what that is. Alright. Mm, our grandpa is the best. That's cute. Our, our grandpa is the best. We got a Shrek glass back there with Fiona on it. A gnome candle burner. Oh, these go with the glasses I have in my booth. Dollar nine each. I forget who makes them. Music Mondays. There's a cute mug with a snowman handle, sock monkey, and let's see, I don't know what HB is, made in, made in Germany, it's got a little stamp on the side too, <clears throat> I don't know what HB is though. It doesn't look interesting enough for me. It's only 69 cents, but I have to be a little bit more fussy. Oh, this is pretty with the stag on it. Oxford in time. Okay. Well, we'll look that one up and see what that what that is uh, all about. Simmer down, just roll with it. That's cute. And what is this one? It's beginning to look a lot like Christmas. We have a plain mug. Ooh, that's a nice ceramic mug. Nice color. Ooh, nice menorah one. It looks older. It's not. There's the hug in the mug is still here. 
Merry Christmas. It's a stackable. But the other ones are not here. And what's down here? Coffee house, teapot. I don't. Hmm. Are we going to go mugless today? Is that actually going to happen? Because I don't see anything. That's a nice rise and shine. That's pretty. Pottery. Yeah, don't know what that is. Oh, I can't make it out. Let me see. Let me see what these... Pendleton? No. They're not that great looking. But we'll put them in the cart and see what, what's going on with them. This one is the one that caught my eye. It says Pendleton. Made in Thailand. I don't know. We'll see. Is that the Pendleton or it's just another Pendleton? Do some research. And I don't see any more like it. What is this? Oh, Texas. Texas souvenir mug. They have quite an interesting handle. That's what caught my eye, too. Uh, I don't see anything else here that I want to grab. Nope. Okay. That would be it for the mugs. It's a zebra one. Okay. All right, we have these animated display figures, but they want $9.09 each for Mr. and Mrs. Claus, so they're going to stay here. Oh, yeah, those big ones I got a couple weeks ago. Oh, that's a nice tin. Santa greetings. 309. Nope, not that nice. This is a cool, uh, this is a cool thick bowl. Pier 1. That's quite substantial. These are nice, but one's broken. Really pretty colors. Alright, um, let's see what else we have. Let's look over here for a minute. And we have more tin. Oh, look at this. That's all ceramic for $13.09. That is heavy. We have this old tin, but it's all dented up. I'm not going to $309. Now they're $309. It's amazing. All right. I'll be back. All right. We're going to look in the dishes. Here's an Arkansas Razorback snack tray thingy. We have some cups and saucers. Some pretty blue dishes right there. More cups and saucers. These have lemons on them. More Christmas. These are kind of cool. The half eggs. They're kind of neat. I like them. They're different. And look down here. That's really pretty. That <clears throat> snack tray. Let's see what that's all about. I like the colors on it. And move that out of the way. Oh, that's pretty. And that is so... Uh, hmm. I don't know what that says. What does that say? Um, what does that say? Anyway, that's really pretty. The 309. Somebody should grab that. That's very funky. I like funky stuff. It's on it. Push it back here so it doesn't get... Kicked her hit with a cart. All right. That's a neat dish right there, the blue one. I don't know what that's for, but it's got like a rattan on it. And it's a piece of art pottery down there. We have a plate that says mmm and yum. It's cute. It's look like Linux. They're not. They're not the quality of Linux, but yeah, they're just Gibson. I'm only going to get Christmas if it's something really, really good because the Christmas is not selling that well at my booth this year, so. Oh, look, an Amish butter print all. Don't put your Pyrex in the dishwasher. Isn't that a shame? Poor thing. Blue glass plate. Some cardinals on the bowls. And uh, that's it for the dishes and plates. Nothing 
Nothing else interesting. Oh, there's succulents. Oh, it's plastic. It's very pretty. Nice succulents. Strawberries, too. All right, moving on. This is a cool, big Santa plaster door greeter, and he's 1009. Pretty color. Too big for me to get, though, but worth showing. It's a nice sewing box there on the cart for 1309. And it says sewing something, missing knob inside. All right. Then we're here with the frames and such. Here's a cute one. It's got faux fur on it. And those look like uh, watercolor. I mean, like, uh, I can't think of the word. Oh, there's an old picture. There's an old picture. That's cool. I like that. It's probably on cardboard. You're welcome. 609 Wide Pine Prints. Serene setting by Monetti. That's what it says right there. Pressed in the back of it. That's pretty cool. Looks like maybe a old doctor's office might have had that. This is cute. It says Kathy's Shadow Peewee. And it's signed Campbell. And it's a duck on some rainbow colored thing. I'm not really sure. I'm not really sure about that. Uh, more frames, shadow box type frames, a disc display, and oh, that's a pretty frame with the flowers on it. That is 209. It's really nice. I like that. Very pretty. Very pretty indeed. I haven't had much luck showing you guys interesting stuff here in the picture frames. There's a old beach scene. It's upside down. Corkboard. Uh, a fisherman painting. And that's about it. That's about it over here.
in for winter. Maybe I'll grab that and put it in the cart. And see what else we have, some mooses. Some moose, he's cute. Look at them, aren't they adorable? Now we have a train Christmas ornament. We have cookie cutters. There's that magical Santa from last week. Snow angel, but it's not really a snow angel. Not really a snow angel. Cheese spreaders are still here. Stockings, candles. Is this an elf hat? No, nope, it's a stocking. More stockings, more wreaths. Got gift bags. They have this cute little uh, snowman, but he's all chipped up. A little cocoa tin. Oh, this is a neat tin. It looks like a flower pot. That's, oh no, it's two. Duh. Uh, I'm going to stay away from the blatantly Christmas ones. And what else do we have here? Another little tin. And that's it for the Christmas miscellaneous. I'm not really seeing anything else I want to look at. More tins, but they're kind of small. So we're going to pass on them. But that's it. Oh, look at the clown. Yeah, look at the clown. Look at the clown. No, oh, he's a creepy clown. Look at that guy. <laughs> creepy Christmas clown. All right, we're going to leave him behind. Moving on. We have a big globe stuck here in the toy aisle. It's 709. It's made by General something. But nothing for me. Oh, look, a box of syringes in the toy aisle. That's lovely. We have Elmo and bears and dinosaurs and the hairless um, monster high doll has made her way into that section. And some teddy bears up here, some frogs. There's a Mickey Mouse. Not that interested. Very hard to sell Mickey Mouse. There's so much of it out there. And another Mickey Mouse. I'm gonna try to get my cart around here. Can get it through. I'm trying to get it through here without knocking the fire extinguisher over. It's a little macrame type kit thing. <gasps> Look at these owls. I don't know what they do, but they're cute. They are cute. Adorable. And. We have oh, Minnie Mouse, so you can get a Minnie and a Mickey. Not my thing, not my thing. Not unless it's a special one. And that looks like a horse. Oh, that says Sweetheart Teddy. Okay, what is this? Ring Bearer's Pillow. Find interesting things over here, that's for sure. Barbie, some shoes. Cabbage Patch. Big old rhino. It looks like he's got some... Oh no, he's made that way with those lines. He's cool. I don't know who makes him. But he's a biggin. And then we have this tabletop collage box up here. Interesting. I wanted to go down the mishmash, but there's too many people there. So we're going to look at some toys. We can look at some... Uh, purses too maybe let's come over here and look at some purses I'm not grabbing Percy the I still have to sell the purses I have so I'm not worried about these what is this it's nothing and I like unique that stands out to me something really interesting pattern or style that's metal mesh that's kind of cool Metal mesh on both sides, but I'm not seeing anything really good here to show you guys. I don't like the tan stuff either. Okay, that's about it for over here. What is that? Is that a Monster High? I can't 
Ooh, I can't get in there. Let me see. Sorry if I made everybody dizzy. I was trying to get around something. Where did it go? Here it is. Is it Monster High? Um, it is. Little Monster High purse. How cute. How much do they want for that? Three bucks. Eh, I'd rather just stick to the dolls. Kenneth Cole. We got a Lily Bloom there. We have a llama. Oh, he's cute. Little llama. All right, we're done here in the purses. All right, here we are in the wood aisle. My humans are getting married. Oh, that's cute. We have a bell. We have hors d'oeuvre picks, but they're 309. Oh, well, somebody took the car out of the box. They didn't like the price. There's no place like home except grandma's. There's this. It's a burner. A tart burner. We have a Fortnite Nerf sickle. Family night popcorn here. It's a cute wooden box with a chicken and chicks on it. 209 for that. And I guess this is a cheese board with the it has two of the knives. Well, that's kind of cool. 309 for that. I don't need that. Wash your hands by order of the management. <laughs> Laundry sucks since forever. I've gotten a few uh, interesting signs here in the past. Baskets are still wiped out behind me. Gone to the beach. Curved glass photo frame. Oh, that's a cute little letter thing. Salt and pepper, they're 309 each, so we're gonna leave them here. We have a Merry Christmas Owl. And what is this? Oh, it's a doggy. Hello, doggy. It's just a print. There's an apple. The peacocks are still here. I didn't even check the color of the day, so. Um, don't see. I don't know what. Oh, that's probably a dartboard, more than likely. And um, I have to wait. She's stocking stuff here, so. What are these? Uh, they're just fleur de lis. Okay. I think this is an old napkin holder, a little wooden one. That's cute. All right. And, well, there's one peacock is here. I don't see the other one. What are these? Are these metal? I can't tell. I feel like cardboard. That's a cool animal. Made out of wood. Then we have this horse. No need for them. Which is this wood slice, 109. It's a nice wood slice for a dollar nine. Nice larger one. It's got a nice bullseye. I might be able to do something crafty with that. We have a parasol in there. Oh, here's another. Uh, here's another one of those wicker bottles. This one has the top on it. The top isn't on the other one. I might end up putting that one back. We'll see. I'll have to look up the name. Jason Kid ornament. 309 for that. No, thank you. Uh, some frames. That's a pretty frame. I like that. Which is that one? 309 for that. A little shell decorated box. Mini crate is still here. And what is under here? What is this? Uh, I think it's a uh, cookbook holder. Another cutting board, shelves, and such. That is it for the wood. What is that thing? Oh, it's a clock. That's an interesting clock. Imagine your dream, create your happiness, live your life. Very nice. All right, we are done over here. All right, we're here in the mishmash. We have an angel candle holder, frosted glass. We're gonna pass on. Don't know what, I think that's for your pencils. I can't quite open it here, so it's gonna stay. 
And what do we have? Oh, we have the noisemaker thingies. We have a dog puzzle. These are portable pet food and water dishes. I think. Avalanche. That's what I thought it was. Am I wrong? I don't know, but for 89 cents, we'll give that a try. I might need that for traveling sometime. Scrapbooking diapers. There's the smaller globe they brought out. It's like a gold tones. And it's a big mess here. More diapers. Bio filter. What is this? Oh, they make little troll cassette boxes. If they weren't troll themed, I would have got them. They're kind of cute. I like them. 12 days of selfies. Interesting. More bio filters. Marine Land bio filters. Okay. This is a flashlight. Bat girl. Mini building blocks. Oh, they're like little uh, Minecraft building blocks. How cute. I wonder how many are missing though. Because it's all taped up. Oh, look at purple stuff on me from something. That's lovely. Gotta love it here. That's what happens when you get in the mishmash aisle. You get stuff on. I hope it isn't from this. No, it's not from this. Alright, well. That's great. That purple on me. Oh, what is this? Oh, a sugar skull something and a... Uh, what is this? Oh, they're just mittens. They look like some of these mittens that they wore here. Alright, it's, it's rubbing off my hands. Million dollar puzzle. What was the thing? I saw something interesting. I'm afraid to touch stuff here now. I really am. Nail buffer. Oh, that's cool. 209 for those. I use them when I craft, when I do stuff. I saw something here that was an interesting pattern. Now I don't see it. What is this? Woohoo. Uh, happy exclamation cards. Interesting. Okay, let's move over here. I can't really get down this side yet. There's some Brenda Har. Brenda actually got some Brenda Har. Uh, what is this? This is a... I don't know what it is. Synmax wireless USB adapter. But I don't know what it does. Very strange. There's a cute little notebook. I can't get very close to this because there's stuff all over. There's more Brenda Har. See, there's stuff all over the floor. It's hard to get the carts by. We have some notebooks. And puzzles. Trimmer line, some decorations. All right, hold on, guys. I gotta move. All right, I'm starting from this end. We got the Star Wars crochet, but it's not what's in there, and it's opened. And I don't know what that is. Something for Halloween. More Brenda Har. More Brenda Har here. Some braids. Those would be good for crafting with, making dolls. I don't know what all this stuff is. Looks like a little travel kit. Taper candles. Toothbrush. Glitter. Some Christmas boxes. Lanyards are still here. What is this? Club chair cover. More Brenda Har. We have the blue and the burgundy up top today. More Brenda Har. More Brenda Har. So Brenda Har, if you, if you want another color, let me know. Ooh, we have gray braids. Those are cool. Like those. And we have more diapers, more stuff in here that I don't know. I'm not going to dig through it because I already have purple fingers. And that's about it. We're going to finish it off here. This is interesting. It's an Air World Crisper. I don't know how to use it, but cooks and reheats foods to crispy perfection. That's interesting. The lid that turns an ordinary pan into a stovetop air fryer. Oh, cool. I don't know if it's used or not. 
I might have just put a used one in here. Uh, $10, $10 for that. So we're going to leave that. All right, we're here in the knickknacks aisle. We have a little hedgehog. We have a cute hanging, like, glass lantern for your candles. A snowman votive burner. This is a cool vase. It's very new, but I like the... I like the drip on it. These are little uh, tulips. There's two of them there, different color. And there's art pottery right here. There's a vase. Very cool. Ooh, that's a neat shape, whatever that is under there, but I don't want to move stuff. I don't want to touch it. Okay. And my green jars are still here with no price on them. Nope, oh, they have a price now. That's cool. I just don't know the color of the, the day. Okay. This is cool. It's a lid to something. I don't know what it's a lid for. There's a little fairy back there with her birds. And this is a cool mug, but the elephant's trunk is broken off. So, have yourself a merry little Christmas bottle, soap dish, let love grow, that's kind of cute, and another elephant mug, this is pretty, oh, there's a few of them, they've got that black and gold trim, can you see that, that's really nice. Big bowls. These are cool. There's three of these. They're kind of neat. I like those little bud bases, or you could use them as a diffuser. And more mugs, a fish. Oh, cute little owls, but not not special enough. Not special enough. There's a nice mug. Is that the one with the birds again? That's the third time I've seen that one with the birds on it. What is this? Ooh, that's a pretty color one. Votive holder. So we have that one. And we have the red one. I wonder if there's a blue one around. I really like the color of this one, though. But there's only one. It looks like it might glow. It's got that look about it. Don't need it. It's not that spectacular. It's a great color, though. I really like the color. There, I'm just thinking about it. Patriotic planters are still here. Oh, this is neat. It's a plate, and the hummingbird is in the middle of it, but um, he's broken. His tail and his beak is broken. Little figurines. Here's a cute little whale bank by Pearhead. He's cute. I like him. And. More figurines, Applejack shot glass, basket, and a little jar. There's a dish with violets on it. What is that? It's got measuring in there. Cool. And let's see what else we have. More glasses, mugs, Georgia coasters. That milk glass piece, that cup or whatever it is, vase that looks like a shell is still here. We have uh, peas in a pod. It's cute. A little bitty vase. Oh, who remembers these? The elephant earring holder. <gasps> Remember those? He might have to. He might have to come home with me trying to find a good place for him that he's not going to fall down. Well, I'm almost to the end of the aisle anyway. What does that say? That says... I don't know what it says. George and Martha Washington. That's kind of cool. 209 for that. I don't know what it says up there. Oh, Mount Vernon. It's Mount Vernon. Uh, duh. Okay. We have a teapot with a clock in it. 
some glasses, canisters down there, broken doggies, ice cream cone holders, and all right, we'll look at the other side. All right, we're on this side. Oh, that's a beautiful working clock. It's $21.09. It's like an apothecary jar here. And let's see what else we have here. Art pottery. Art pottery mugs. Oh, they got a stamp in the side. They're kind of interesting. Let's grab them and we'll see. What, oh, my goodness, there's five of them. All right, let me grab these. Hold on. All right, I grabbed them because I want to research the uh, maker of those. Jack-o'-lantern. Merry Christmas sign. What are these? Shot glasses. Uh, oh, those were from some kind of princess party, it looks like. A little crowns on the top. Those are older. Glasses. Um, now here's another one. It's, oh, this one's flashed. See, it's flashed. You see all the color coming off? Flash dyed, whatever you want to call it. Oh my goodness, people are tearing stuff apart here today. It's insanity. That's very pretty. Looks like thumbprint. We have a bowl. And he's a piggy. Piggy bowl. PJ Maxx. Not that crazy about him. He's, he's all right. He's all right. He'll find a home, I'm sure. There's a doggy dish that says Bone Appetit. And are you an owl? You're an owl, but you're not that fantastic. $1.09 for that. I'm not really interested in that one. I don't really like the coloring on it. Give thanks to the Lord. It's a little blown glass angel. The Lord, for he is good. Well, he's only 69 cents. Should I get him? Um, if you haven't already done so, please subscribe to my channel. Hit that bell, notification bell, set it to all. Comment under the video, give us a like. And as always, pinned to the top comment under my video will be a link to a playlist of all my Thrift With Me videos. And you can go back and watch some of the fantastic finds I used to find here. And let's see what else we have. Candle holders, little pictures, little milk glass cups. I don't know what that is back there. Let's see. It's hidden. Aw, that's cute. The little flower cup and saucer. That's adorable. $1.39 for that. I don't know. I don't know if anybody's going to want this. It is cute. We'll grab it. We'll grab it for now. It's a possibility. More bottles. This is a cool tea set down here. It's neat. If it had dragons on it, I would be getting it. Because you can't go wrong with dragons. We have another one of these tall vases here. The raspberries are still here. Made a good call not to get them. Little faux succulents in the jar down there. And uh, that's about it for the knickknacks. Here's a cool green apple terrine and a nice glass vase. Pretty cool. And here is an adorable old car planter. And that is 309. That's cute, it's different. I like it. I just don't want to be stuck with it, but it is cute. Nice older piece. Beep, beep. This is a cute vintage tray, but as you see on the reindeer, it's all scratched up and the paint is missing. That's a nice vintage one right there. Very cute. Hopefully it'll find a home. Really, really cute. So I just wanted to share this with you. It's a metal like southwestern uh, theme wall hanging. I don't know if it had something that was sitting in there, like a thin piece of glass or something. See the lip that goes around the back? But it is a very cool piece. I just wanted to show it to you guys. 
Really neat. I just came back down the mishmash aisle. This is vintage. It's made in USA. My sister had a yellow one. And it's a crumb catcher bib. It's plastic. But it's got that lip to catch the food. Wow, that is a blast from the past. They want 209 for it. Baby World, made in USA. That is cool. That brings back memories. I don't even know if they still make these, but this is a vintage one. Very cool. Very cool. All right, we're going to do a recap here. Um, and again, if you haven't already done so, please hit that subscribe button. Hit that notification bell. Set it to all. Leave a comment below. Leave a like. And also pin to the first comment under my video will be a link to all my Thrift With Me videos. So give them a look-see. I'm telling you, you got to go back a ways and see some of the great stuff I got. This apparently is Fenton um, for a lighter. They made Fenton lighters. You see the lip on there. It's sort of got that amberina to it. So we're going to get that. Pretty piece. Um, this wooden, old wooden wood windmill. That's very cute. A little planter. It's like redware, made out of redware. I like the drip on it. It's pretty neat. I'm going to get this uh, Vera, Vera box. The kitty cat, well, let me show you this. This is a shelf riser. This is, I'm going to use this at my booth so you can fit uh, more stuff when you have variable uh, levels on your shelves. I'm getting the kitty cat. His hat is bent and his paint is chipped and he's missing his nose, but we'll fix him. I just think he's cute. I can't leave him behind. I'm only getting two tins. I'm getting the Pendleton glasses mugs um, this stuff you see on here you can use a magic eraser and get those black marks off of it but they're made to look like the blankets getting this cute little kitty cat right here I'm gonna get the wicker covered bottles one of them is signed by the artist uh, turns out this right here let me try to get there we go that is a McCoy um, planter very cool. I'm going to get that. Can you always use wood slices? So I'm going to get that. Those are really pretty though. I really like them for some reason. One of them has the cap and one of them doesn't, but that's fine. You just stick a cork in it. Um, I'm going to get some clothes here. I'll show you. I'm probably going to get this one. This is from Bush Gardens, but it's beautiful. The tiger with its baby. It's very pretty. I was going to get this hat, but I'm going to put it back. It's suede, but it's kind of flimsy, and I don't, I don't really like it anymore. The, the feeling has passed. I'm going to get the angel. I'm going to get the elephant that holds the earrings. The vintage elephant earring. And you probably put a ring on his trunk there. I'm going to get this. There's five of them. That's art pottery. And they are signed, as you can see right there. I just don't know who it is. But they're a pretty design. So I'm going to get all of those. And they're not round. You see how they're like round and then kind of straight across, almost straight across the back where the handle is. So I just thought they're cool. And then Groove Moose. I'm getting that for somebody. It's already spoken for. I'm getting the... Um, Pulp Fiction themed t-shirt. I'm not going to show it very long. I've got a Pride Proud shirt. Looks like it's in new condition. And uh, a Doctor Who shirt. It's only a size large, but I'm sure I'll find somebody for it. So, let me put these back in here. And that's about it for today. Not a stellar day, but it's something. Uh, Denise never came, so... I guess I'm not doing Waffle House with her, so I'm going to head home. Uh, I have a sale today. I have to do a sale. It's all rings. So um, you'll be seeing this after the sale. This will be posted the following Sunday. Uh, I think the 17th this will be showing up. So, But uh, thank you for watching, everybody. And until next time, see you on the flip side. Thank you for watching. See you at the next one. Bye, everybody.